Shalom. First of all, I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Racha HaKodash. Yahweh being the true, almighty, and powerful name of the Heavenly Father, who the world ignorantly calls God. And His only begotten Son's name is Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Bahashem in the name. Racha, Spirit. Kodash is uh, holy. All right. Of course, I want to give a uh, double honor to the elders and apostles. That great millstone who were well. Peace and salutations, all sincere Akim. They're out there on the highways and hedges, risking their lives and freedom, of course, to do the work of the Lord. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right. To, of course, make their call and election sure. Working their salvation out with all fear and trembling. I'm the brother Mafa from Great Millstone Play Tables Camp, located okay, here in Babylon, in America. Which I hate this fucking place. Alright. Um, <laughs> coming again with this truth. Alright. I fucking hate this place. But anyway. Um, you know. Slakia for. Uh, you know. You say the rude speech. But. I mean. I actually originally did this lesson. But. You know. The mic wasn't. Uh, it, it, it recorded. Pretty much. Ten minutes of the lesson. But. It disconnected. Alright. Man. Or. Yeah. Yeah, the cord had disconnected, and I didn't notice it. So, you know, eight minutes, the rest of it, you know, uh, you know, wasn't recorded you know, audio-wise. So, I'm going to have to do this to the best of my ability for my memory. You know, Bob Rats' eye, this just be a bit better, well, more put together. But anyway, so going on to it, I was, uh, in the prior lesson, I was going into this precept, which is Ecclesiasticus 29, and I believe it's... Ninth, what was it? Uh, is it uh, actually, it was, I think, Ecclesiasticus 31 and 19. It says, A very little is sufficient for a man well natured. All right, so you know, you know, I was hitting that just this part of the precept, you know, saying, you know, very little because you know, you don't need that much. Being here in this truth, you know, you just need, you know, your daily bread, right? You know, and, um, you know, enough that, you know, you don't, uh, pretty much, uh, don't, um, like, a, like, uh, it says here, and I was, I visited in the prior lesson, but just to bring it out, again, it says, uh, uh, Least I be full and not and deny thee and say who is the Lord, or least I be poor, and steal and take the name of 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 my power in vain. So you know, like I said, give me poverty. Give me neither poverty nor riches, but feed me. But it say here, feed me with food convenient for me. All right, you know and uh. Now the food obviously we need is this truth really to be honest because you know all hell about to break loose. Uh quack is the Hebrew word for convenient. Uh let me see what I can get out of this. For convenient. Prescribe do. Alright, prescribe proportion. Alright. You know that's 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 good. You know, com it got commandments. Right, so and that's pres prescribed by the power he got in this definition. So, prescribed it says, uh, authorized for use. All right, which our physician is Yahweh Shemel Shai, and he giving us uh, food and medicine, making us whole again. All right, you know, so anyway. Going back to the actual scripture, right? A little, very little is sufficient for a man, well natured, you know, and that's well nourished, and you know, that's a man that's, you know, getting this truth, getting all this uh, wisdom, knowledge, understanding, getting fed. All right, you know. So I'm gonna go in now, back to uh, Philippians. All right, this is Philippians four and uh, five. And it says, let your moderation be known unto all men. The Lord is at hand. All right. When we go to moderation. All right. 
It means avoidance of excess and extremes. All right, especially in one's behavior. They got political opinions, but that's basically it. All right, you know, men supposed to know that. You know, you, you know, you you really just uh, living after your whole boss shimmy out with shy. You know, you're not uh, all into you know this whole world and all that. You know, because this whole world they got greater extremes. All right, uh, you know, lust of the flesh that you go after that can get you destroyed. All right. Um, let me see. Five minutes in. So going on, it says, uh, "Be careful for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication, which we beg the Yahweh Shai, with thanksgiving, let your request be made unto the Most High." It says, "In the peace of the power." Which passeth all understanding shall keep your hearts and your minds through Hamashiach, Yahweh Shai. All right, you know when you know we pray, and Yahweh Shemel Shai gives us a, you know this understanding in our mind, our lab. All right, you know, and of course uh, we get that. You know we pray to the Most High through Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai being our mediator. All right, and that through that you know we we pray that. You know, we had his wisdom, eyes understanding, so it could be our stability of the times that's coming. Jacob's trouble, all hell break loose. All right, so it goes on. Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, and whatsoever things are honest, and whatsoever things are just, and whatsoever things are pure, which the words of Yahweh Bashem Shai are pure, it says, and whatso whatsoever things are lovely, and whatsoever things are a good report, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, think on these things, you know, so you have to think on the things of uh, of righteousness. That's which really is this truth. All right. You know, everything and it's a moth. All right. So now we're going to go to Ecclesiasticus 29 and it's a. Uh, I'm going to start here at uh, 21. And it says, the chief all right, thing of for life is water. So, you know, you're saying like the most important things, right? It's water and bread. All right. Which, you know, the wor word is, uh, I mean, like, you know, living water. All right. And bread, you know, like the like, it's, like Lord say, uh, man shall not live by bread alone, but every word that. You know, the power, you know, roughly paraphrasing, you know, it says in clothing and a house to cover shame. It says better is the life of a of a poor man in a mean cottage than a delicate fare in another man's house. You know, when I'm going into it, you know, a mean meaning uh, when you go into it. Mean is a low quality, all right. So let me get let me get it real quick. Low quality, uh, yeah, right here, century twelve, twelve, twelve hundred, right. Also, it got inferior, second rate, you know. So you may, of course, uh, being in this truth, you know, you may have to, of course, uh. You know, uh, be in a house that, uh, you know, is a mean cottage, you know, second rate, you know, but, you know, that's just what it is. That that could be a lot, you know, why you're enduring, you know, till your house shy comes. You know, there's going to be times when, of course, brother's going to have to do that, tarry in certain places because, you know, it's take of trouble and, and such, you know, but, you know, it's better, better is the life of a poor man. In a mean cottage, in a delicate fair in another man's house, you know. So, you know, you you know, obviously, you fair you pavement right for you know, journey right. Uh, man, another man's house, right? You know, you can be in another man's house, and you gotta go by, you know, this other man's house and his ways and all that, and you know, dude might be fucking wicked as his light, you know, or a heathen. You know, and they, you know, do things contrary to the law, statute, commandments. All right. But anyway, you know, the point being, you know, is this, uh, you know, having 
be, being a well-natured man and being able to just be sufficient with what's, you know, having little, all right? So you ain't got to have the whole damn fucking world, all right? You know, because this world is wicked anyway. You know, you just need this wisdom to understand it, all right? You know, this is a modest life and all that, you know? It says, be, be it's like it, verse 23, be it little or much, hold thee contented. That thou hear not the reproach of thy house. Alright. It says for it is a miserable life to go from hoose to hoose. You know basically you know as a vagabond. Alright. You know even Yahweh Shai. He had to of course he didn't have no place to lay his head. You know who the world ain't called Jesus Christ. You know, well you know he, like you know he, he had to go house to house. Alright. You know. Um. You know, so he had a miserable life and such, you know, he, you know, tarry certain places, lodge, you know, certain places and such. So as for where thou art a stranger, thou darest not open thy mouth. All right. So, you know, you know, it is what it is, you know, but, you know, it's better, you know, for a poor man to be in a mean cottage. All right. Simple as that. You know, this point being this light, this truth. You know, uh, you know, you, you get changed, of course, to a lower state, you know, uh, you know, you may, of course, have to go through that, you know, I had to go through it, all right, still going through it, uh, you know, in a certain sense, you know, because, I mean, we ain't got, uh, fucking palaces yet, you know, it's low quality compared to what we gonna have in the kingdom, you know, so, yeah, they say uh, uh, Ecclesiasticus two, and uh, and um, I'll say I'll start here at verse three. It says, "Cleave unto him, depart not away, that thou mayest be increased at thy last end." So you gotta stay faithful to Yah Bashem Yah Shai. All right, especially when you're being, of course, in temptation, being tried out. Y'all about to make sure testing out your character and stuff and your integrity. It says, whatsoever is brought upon thee, take cheerfully and be patient when thou art changed to a to a low state. All right, you know, so you know, we in our hell, you know, so you know that's what the low state is, you know, because look. For God, for gold is tried through the in the fire, and acceptable men, acceptable men in the fire of adversity, you know, and, you know that that's having very little, all right. But you know you have to, you know, know that of course, you know, uh, you know you can maintain, you know, you had this truth, all right, faith, amoth, you know, truth, the truth, and amawan, all right. Let that be what gets you through, you know, as you, uh, you know, are going through whatever you're going through. So with that, I'm just going to close out, you know, just give you some encouragement, you know, uh, I'm going to say Shalom.